In a recent interview, DRDO Chairman G. Satish Reddy revealed that India's first developmental trial of a Nirv Hay cruise missile, equipped with an indigenous small turbofan engine, built by DRDO's gas turbine research establishment, GTRE, will be conducted in the coming days. The gas turbine research establishment, Bengaluru, had undertaken the project to design and develop a 450 kgf thrust class, small turbofan engine, aimed for unmanned aerial vehicle application. The STFE engine is a generic twin spool engine without afterburn. It is an expendable single-use, short-life turbofan engine, comprising of various modules. GTRE had also undertaken the task of developing other subsystems and line replacement units, like alternator, prio system, fuel injection, digital engine control system, with Indian public private R&D establishment and industries. Nirv Hay is India's first indigenously designed and developed long-range cruise missile. It is a subsonic, long-range land attack cruise missile that can be armed with a 200 to 300 kg warhead. It is capable of carrying conventional and nuclear warheads. Reportedly, the nuclear-capable, solid-fuel missile can reach top speeds of 0.6 to 0.7 Mach and can strike land targets at a distance of up to 1,000 km. It weighs about 1,500 kg and has a length of 6 meters. It can be launched from multiple platforms. The missile is capable of flying at different altitudes, ranging from 500 meters to 4 kilometers above the ground, and can also fly at low altitudes to avoid detection by enemy radar. The missile has a loitering capability, which means it can circle a target and undertake a series of maneuvers before re-engaging it. It is capable of being used from air, land and ships, and submarines. The Nirv Hay long-range land attack cruise missiles used in past tests were all powered by Russian-made NPO Saturn 36MT mini-turbofan engines. But India is replacing it with a more indigenous system that includes a new radio frequency seeker. The Indian Navy and the Defence Research and Development Organisation have agreed to collaborate on the development of a new, long-range land attack cruise missile that will have a longer range than Army and Air Force variants, and will be deployed on frontline naval warships as well as India's nuclear attack submarine program. A separate air-launched variant and submarine-launched variant is also under active development. On the 24th of June 2021, the eighth trial of Nirvhe was successfully test-fired from the integrated test range at Chandipur. Gas Turbine Research Establishment is also developing a new 4.25 kN thrust turbofan engine to power Nirvhe cruise missile and future UAV long-range anti-ship missile systems.